Operatives of the Nigeria Customs in Kano have confiscated a variety of contraband items worth more than 22 million naira smuggled into the country through illegal routes and kept in the state warehouses. The customs officers say the operation was carried out in line with their commitment when ensuring banned foreign goods are not in the markets. Stevenson News Kano correspondent Ibrahim Isa reports. It's been months since the federal government ordered for the reopening of land borders. Since the reopening, the Nigeria Customs have warned traders to desist from smuggling cotton bad items in the country. At the Kano Jigar Customs headquarters, strike force team of the command stomped warehouses in a bid to ensure smuggled foreign items are not being kept and sold in the markets. The operation yielded results. The customs officers were able to seize 264 bags of rice, 818 tomato paste, 249 condensed milk, 74 cartons of couscous, 318 cartons of spaghetti. We have been well equipped and prepared to follow them to look and corner of anywhere we find anything like this, whether in the warehouses, on the road, in the market. Our men are compatible enough to put a stop to it. So they will have their money and all their investment from at the end of the day. Chairman of the popular single market in Kano, Ubazubeiru, who visited the command when notified about the operations, promised to cooperate with the council in ensuring that local products are encouraged to excel in the country. We will not tolerate any trader engaging in any illegal business in the markets. Whoever is found wanting will be dealt with. The customs emphasize their commitment to work harder in ensuring smuggling business becomes unprofitable in the country. Ibrahim Isa, TVC News, Kano.